Ali's Eco Home Store is a, a spin-off of the Eco Products Building Supply Division. And Eco Products I founded in 1990. And about in 2006, Eco Products transitioned to a wholesale manufacturer of food service products. So we had this building supply division that was kind of complicating the marketplace. So we spun it off into Ellie's Eco Home Store. Not only spun it off, but uh, got a twice as big retail space, added over 2,000 SKUs, different products, and Ellie's is what it is today from that spinoff. Is currently one location. Uh, we consider this a concept store uh, and eventually hope to open up additional stores. It really was an idea that my dad had. Uh, he was chairman of the board of EcoCycle. And if you can picture the three recycle arrows in the recycle symbol, you know, the first one is collection, second one is remanufacturing, and the third one is getting those products from the manufacturers back to the consumers. At that point in time, nobody was doing that. So that was really how the idea was conceived, was to bring environmental products, specifically at that time recycled products, to the marketplace. And that's how we started. And that's really what Ellie's does today. Eco Products, as I mentioned in 2006, moved from a retail distributor to a wholesale manufacturer. When we opened Ellie's two years ago, we added a lot of general merchandise and apparel, natural apparel, organic apparel. So we kind of took the concept a little bit further into an environmental department store. So it's almost an environmental target meet Home Depot. And that's really the concept. So we have 12 departments, everything from apparel, you know, health and beauty, pets, office supplies. The Green Building Center is still the nucleus of the store. It's in the center of the store. It's really our primary focus, but we wanted to supply lots of other natural products. So when people come in to buy carpet, they can get some compostable bags and environmental laundry detergent on the way out and vice versa if they come to our refill station for our non-toxic cleaners they'll see our natural carpets or bamboo or cork or linoleum and they'll think to themselves oh, I'm doing a remodel next spring I know where to go so it's kind of cross marketing this is what we do it's what we know we're educated about it so not only you can get all your information and products in one store but we feel like we know about these products we've been through the pains and sufferings of what products work, what don't, um, probably more than most. It's a battle that you know you're going to win because people aren't stupid. It's just a matter of education. It's a little bit like organic foods. You know they're better for you. That's why Whole Foods is successful. So people just need to be educated and eventually the battle will be won. I mean eventually you run out of oil. Eventually you know this earth only has so many resources so I'm hopeful and we have no choice, so eventually we're gonna to have to change our ways.